Hey guys, what's up? Uh, it's I took Apple 96 here, and today I'm going to show you how to uh, compress down your videos. So if you've made a video in uh, what I have here, Final Cut Pro, or in iMovie, I'm going to show you how to use Final Cut Compressor. So that's part of the Final Cut Studio package. So um, first I'll show you how to compress your videos on um, Final Cut, and then second I'll show you how to compress them on iMovie. So say you have a clip here. I have this clip right here. Um, let's play it. It's just a clip. You've seen this hey guys, video I'll earlier. Well here. And um, you'll find if you compress this, this is videos 720p. I recorded my iPod Touch. So if you have this video um, and you export it, you're going to end up with a huge like 800 megabyte file. It's going to take like four hours to upload to YouTube. So if I want to upload that to YouTube, all I have to do is on Final Cut is I'll go back to the beginning of the video and um, I'll click this. If you had multiple clips, you click this one and then you have to scroll over it, see where your next clip is, press control and keep clicking them until you've had them all highlighted. But make sure they're all highlighted like highlighted like this, clicked. And then we're gonna click file and then click send to Oh uh there we go send to compressor so I click compressor now file cut compressor should open up okay so now you see a compressor is opened and you have your uh, settings here it says this is the final cut your videos in there so we'll start by clicking right here we'll go um, so if we're uploading to YouTube we're gonna be using a uh, compressor that's for YouTube so we'll click it's in the Apple um, wait, oh yeah, Apple, oh no, that's destinations, okay, sorry about that, we'll go back to the Apple one again, so we'll open up the Apple, and, uh, we'll go in here to other workflows, uh, down to web, so make sure the web is open, web, make sure that's open, and then scroll right to the bottom of the web, and you'll see there's the list, so it's, those are the open, and you'll see YouTube sharing at uh, H264. So we'll just click on that and we're going to drag it right into here. So now it's there. And then we're going to go to destinations, Apple, and then we're going to drag this des desktop right into where it says source. See where it says that little source? We're going to drop it right where it says source. So now you have it all good for your compressing. So let's click submit. Uh, I'm not going to bother naming it, submit, and now when we go down here, you see it's submitted, and it's going to start compressing my video. So I'll just close that, because I don't need to bother uh, compressing that one. So uh, clear, I'll close compressor, save, and I'll close Fonka Pro. So now I'll show you how to do this in iMovie. So we will open up our iMovie. I'm using iMovie 09. I know the latest iMovie is uh, iMovie 11 now, but it's just pretty much the same. So after you've highlighted your clip, you got them up here. What we have to do is uh, select your clip. You guys know this. And then share, export, and then you go through the steps of options, settings, um, size, export them as a higher, very high size changing to the highest you can get it and then we're gonna um, click save so now it's exporting my project so yeah I'll be back when that is finished exporting uh, so now I'm back and it is finished exporting in uh, iMovie so the export is finished so now I'm just gonna go and quit iMovie so now you should see wherever you saved it, I saved it in documents. It's right here. I just exported it as a um, standard hey definition. Guys, this I is actually, Apple I just exported it as standard definition. And so it'll be quicker. Uh, so now we're going to close that. We're going to go back into compressor now again. So now we're open, compressor is opened. We're going to back to finder. Where I just showed you we're going to go to documents. Now we're going to highlight our project, the one I just exported from iMovie, drag it right here. 
then we're going to close it and now the same steps again uh, scroll down to workflows YouTube sharing drag that in the same as before destinations we're going to go to desktop and we're going to drag the desktop source right to the source and now we should click submit submit and now you will see that is um, submitted right here and it's starting to export anyway guys so now if you have a larger file and you want to upload to YouTube um, you now know how to submit it but um, this is Final Cut Studio it does retail for $9.99 around $1,000 from uh, Apple it comes with Final Cut Pro but if you have iMovie on some of your computer, chances are you, you won't own a compressor. So there's probably some other videos out there on some uh, cheaper options. But uh, anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and catch you next time. See you later. Bye.